Since I was a little boy, I always wanted to serve my country. I signed up to join our armed forces and had high hopes of attending the Naval Academy. I had a full ride ROTC scholarship at NC State. The summer before I could start my service though, I stepped into a car for an afternoon ride. I did not know it would be the last step I ever took. The accident happened so fast, I, I didn't even have time to fight back. The next thing I saw were the lights of the hospital. They said I had a 1% chance of living. I pulled through, but would be paralyzed for life. That day, God changed my plans forever. I struggled. It wasn't easy, but over time we healed. Life would be different now, and that's okay. Once you come face to face with death, you learn what living truly means. God has a purpose for my life, and that is to serve others. No minor setback is gonna change that. I kept serving. I coached, I mentored, I ministered. Through my recovery, I grew closer to my family, closer to my faith. Adversity is an opportunity if you look at it the right way. With hard work, you can overcome anything. That's the way I was raised, the right way, the North Carolina way. This is where I was born and brought up. The people who live in these houses, neighbors, friends, mentors, and family, they raised me right. This is my home. This is North Carolina. Today, our state faces its own unique challenges. Amidst this global pandemic, we've lost our jobs, our businesses, our sports, our schools. We've lost our sense of community. What is happening to our state is wrong. The people of North Carolina are suffering. We need servant leadership now more than ever before. By the grace of God, I am still here today and I am ready to serve. I'm not a politician, I'm a patriot who wants to serve the people of North Carolina. I stand with the people of North Carolina. Their struggle is my struggle. We know how to overcome adversity together. The most important lesson I learned is that we're not guaranteed tomorrow. And that's exactly why I'm running for Congress. God had a calling on my life to serve. I'm not gonna let adversity stand in the way of that. I'm an American. I'm an overcomer. My story is a North Carolina story. We are North Carolina. We are strong and we will overcome.